Okay, so say hello to the future of Lash Wash, you guys. So we have been working on this formula for, I want to say, a little over eight months, um, and we finally got it right. We hope you love it. Uh, we decided to leave even scents out because we know people are super sensitive, totally vegan. Um, it comes in this super cute metal tin. Uh, it's totally clear, again, scent-free, um, super easy to use. Honestly, we just wanted to make it as simple as we could for your clients, for you. The ingredients are really simple, um, but we just wanted something that everybody could be happy with. So I am taking my lash wash brush, and it doesn't matter if you have our lash wash brush. Um, we also have the primer and sealer application brushes. Those are going to be really um, cost effective. I believe that there's a little over 100 in the pack, or maybe it's 100. Um, you'll have to hop on the website to find out, um, but you could use that too if you don't want to use a lash wash brush on every new client because yes I can see that can get very expensive um so these are obviously not reusable for clients unless you're throwing the brush away for my clients I go ahead and give them a lash wash and a brush with their appointment if they need it um, I don't charge for it so when I'm giving them their own, I just go ahead and put a little bit of water um, in the uh, lash soap tin and I mix it up. And you can make it as thick or as thin as you want. You don't need to make it thick. Um, so what I'm doing, I'm basically kind of just putting a layer on the lash. I'm going to let it sit for a few seconds. Um, sorry about the cord. <laughs> I totally forgot to move it, but that's not the point. We're getting to the lash wash, right? So I'm just getting in between each lash. My clients' lashes usually are pretty clean when they come in, but I just want to show you guys up close. Um, I'm using the brush to literally go in between the lashes. You can see how thin the lash wash is. It doesn't hurt their eyes. It's not irritating. It's pretty sensitive on the skin. Um, it's just all around easy an easy to use lash wash product. You can bring it with you when you guys travel they can throw it in their purse it doesn't need to be checked differently because it isn't a liquid but you can see how easy it is to use um, if your clients tend to have makeup on or come with dirty lashes same thing as uh, a, a traditional liquid or foam lash wash you're just going to do it a couple of times um, and I just asked my client if she's feeling any stinging and she said she's not feeling any sensitivity any discomfort um, she just feels like her, her lashes are wet okay so I use our water tincture um, just to uh, obviously rinse the wash out <laughs> and it's funny because when we do our voiceovers I always <laughs> You can see, I always warn my client, you're going to jump. Um, when I do the sped up videos, you don't notice it as much, but it's always so funny because it's so jolting. Actually, that's kind of mean, right? It's not funny, but it ends up being like a, a laugh <laughs> during the appointment every single time. So I'm just rinsing, you guys. It's a really thin wash. If you do have to wash twice, just do the same uh, process twice, wash, rinse. I know some people like to use the plastic squirt bottle where you just squeeze it. That's so much quicker. I just like how everything looks um, cohesive and I like all of my products to match. So that's why I prefer to use our lash tincture um, water, or rather not lash tincture, our water tincture to rinse. I just think it's so cute. Um, and then I'm drying my client's lashes. Oh, there, I just noticed the cord. <laughs> are you guys <laughs> and then I'm just tilting her head doing the other side struggling with the cord <laughs> we have a new light as some of you know so we're kind of going through some of the testing phases and uh working out the phone stand that it comes with and uh yeah so obviously I'm struggling a little bit <laughs> but you can just see how easy it is my client isn't complaining um why we wanted to do a, a bar soap um I we have been trying to do something different and my motto is if you're going to create something it better solve a problem and I don't like the liquid lash wash I just don't like it I think that you know it it um, expires it gets yucky um, if you bring it somewhere and you're traveling it spills it's expensive it doesn't last very long and oftentimes the clients just don't use it so if they're buying a product and they're not using it they're oftentimes not gonna buy another one and they're just going to use their old gross dirty lash wash that they had a year ago I don't want that for my clients and my clients they don't want that for themselves either they just don't want to spend the money 
Again, like I had said before, I give my clients lash wash for free, but I know a lot of people don't. I know a lot of people um, depend on that as a little side hustle and to cover some expenses. And this way, your clients are always going to purchase it. It's so affordable and it lasts for up to six months. Um, Twice a day washing, maybe a little bit less, but it is so, so perfect. I think that this is the perfect solve to all of our lash wash problems. Um, If you guys have any questions, always DM us on Instagram. Um, Feel free to leave a comment on this video. Um, And here I am just showing everything that I used. Our lash shampoo bar, our water tincture, and our um, lash wash brush. I hope you guys understood and loved everything. Again, questions, DM them to us.